good morning to all of you in the last session we have seen the basic very basic of the android programming means we have just drag and drop the controls and we have seen a very basic code of the java today we are going to see how you are going to implement a design in a better manner and how you are going to write a code or you are going to extend the code uh, to check whether the username and password is correct or not so first of all we are going to work on the design so we are not completely or fully going to concentrate on the design now but we are going to improve it in a better manner so i'm just going at the xml now suppose i want to uh, change this one okay so i have written enter username suppose i want to display it in a block how i can do it just i want to give this as a android uh, colon padding okay and i want this padding as a 20 dp so just check it what the change has been done so the size of the text box is improved now you will not find how how exactly size improved so i will do one thing another suppose i want to give the background color to this text box so android colon background sorry colon background so at the rate android colon color and colon white so i have applied white color to the text box if you see the design you will get enter username and the text box has been changed i have given background color for the text box as a background color for the text box as a white and enter username this is the hint now suppose i want to uh, uh, change the size of the text box also now we will check out the uh, control one control one by one this is android colon id every control have a id so i can write id like this now suppose it is a warning giving you just click on it override id resources but i am not going to do any change right now because just i want to keep the id as it is i can change the ids also in a different manner but i want to keep as it is second is layout width okay wrap the content and match the parent you will get two options over here wrap the content and match the parent match the parent means it is going to match with the layout and wrap the contents match the parent means it is going to correspond to the layout and it is going to automatically adjust and the wrap the contents means the, whatever the controls we have drag and drop it will get the proper wrapping of the uh, other controls again android colon margin bottom from the bottom how much margin i want this is the margin i have kept android colon background so at the background color i am giving as a white this is the input type i want to take the input as a text box as a text so txt person name and this is the corresponding from where uh, the top and bottom should be added means at what size the bottom and top should be all these will be applied to other edit text also and this is for the button again if you see the code you will get to you will be understand this is the id this is the wrap content and match wrap content wrapping of the content means it is going to properly adjust all the remaining controls or all the controls as as per the uh, as per the layout and this is the margin we have kept from the left right top bottom like this you can add now i have done one change that is i have added the padding to the text box in the similar fashion suppose i want to add the padding to the password also so android padding so padding should be of 20 dp and again i want to apply the background also so android colon background and i want to color as a white so i have done like this now i want to concentrate on the main activity now here i want to check whether my username and password is correct now temporary i'm i'm setting username as admin and password as admin123 in as a string 
but later we are going to store it in the database so as we are in the learning phase we are not going to connect directly with the database i'm keeping strings in the uh, i'm keeping username and password as a strings so my remaining code will be else if username dot get text dot to string dot equals if my username is admin and password dot get text dot equals dot to string sorry to string dot equals admin one two three I want to display the message the username and password are correct so I'm I'm using toast toast is nothing but it is going to display a message for a particular time interval so toast dot make text now get application context this is the context means uh, get application context means from the current screen I want to display on the current screen I want to display the message I'm giving surface as a success and how much time I want to display the message so toast dot length long and I want to call the method as a show so if my username is admin and my password is admin123 it is going to display the message toast dot make text make text now success will be the display on the screen for a particular time interval if now the last part else if all above conditions are wrong i want to display the message toast message so toast dot make test get application context please check details toast dot length long and I have to call the method show in the latter program we are going to change this and we are going to store it in a database either you can use a SQLite or Firebase any database but afterwards we are not going to store as a string because for the temporary purpose or for the learning purpose I am keeping this as admin admin123 as a plain text so if username is admin and password is admin123 I want to display my success otherwise I want to display the message please check details so when we run this program Now suppose I am giving username as admin and suppose I am giving any wrong password and when I click on this you will get message like please check details. So this is called as toast. When you click on the submit you will get a message please check details and for a particular time interval it is going to display. So this is called as toast. So suppose I am giving the exact username and password admin is a username and password is admin123. And when you click on the submit you will get a success so this was about how you are going to display the message in a in a toast toast is a is nothing but when I want to display a message for a particular time interval I can use a toast now suppose I want to screen I want to add another screen so if my username and password is correct I don't want to display this toast message but I want to go at the next screen so how we are going to add the screen right click on the app click on new click on the activity and click on the empty activity here we have to give the screen name i'm giving this as a next so layout will be activity underscore next and this is the class name of the java and click on the finish you will get two files one that is 
the next file java class and the corresponding resource file so activity underscore next that will be the resource file now suppose i want to display a message so just i'm taking the text view and in a text view i want to display so click on the infer constant now i want to display the message as a welcome so once my username and password is correct i want to display the message as a welcome now here i want to create the activity that is the class is intent intent next is equal to new new intent now here i want to give two parameters one that's get application context from the current screen i want to go at the next screen that is next dot class and i want to call the method start activity now here i want to give the object of the intent class so intent is a class which is provided to, for to go from one screen to another so get application context means from the current screen i want to go at the next screen that is at this class so when you click on the next you will get the id as a text view so just i want to initialize this when you now when you run this program okay you will be directed to next class to the next screen so i'm just running this activity so once you run a program now i'm giving username as a admin and password as admin123 when you click on the submit the next screen will be displayed so like this you can go from one screen to another now we will see the same session in our mother tongue language samja aplyala eka screen pasna dusra screen la jaycha hai pan jar username and password doni correct asel tar aplyala eka screen pasna dusra screen la jaycha asel tar tumhi screen add karun ghevu shakta hai just right click tumhi app la right click kara tyanantar new tyanantar activity ani itha tumhala empty activity choose karaycha hai इतर ऐक्टिविटी नाव दयाच है ऐक्टिविटी नाव दर तेज नाव तुम्हार जावा फाइल्स एक्टिविटी अंडर स्कोर फाइल्स नाव ओके मेन थ्री दैट मीन्स दिस वर्च तो ये तुम्हारे एक्सएमएल स्क्रीन लाइल जेव तुम फिनिश कराल के ऐटोमेटिक दोन फाइल्स तैयार होती पहली फाइल हि लेआउट सा एक्सएमएल फाइल आ दूसरी फाइल हि तुम्हें जावा की फाइल जी जावा डॉट कॉम डॉट एक्जाम्पल या फाइल मे तो हा पैकेज मे कॉम डॉट एक्जाम्पल डॉट साइट ऐप एस आई टी ऐप तो जेव तुम्हें एखाद एखादी ऐक्टिविटी हि ऐड करना एंट्री ऐटोमैटिक एंड्रॉइड मेनिफेस्ट मे पी नेक्स्ट लेक्चर मे अपन प्रत्येक फाइल से डिटेल अपन चेक करना आहोत कि एंड्रॉइड मेनिफेस्ट फाइल ही कैसा वपराय है कि ज्या वैल्यूज आती हा वैल्यूज मे हा जे एक्सएम एल हाँ कसला कारणा वपराय ओके कोडिंग कन्वेन्सनुसार तुम्हारा मैं संगत जाए तो सद्या अपन हा सेशन मे एक गोष्ट बगित है ती मे कि जेव अपने एक स्क्रीन पास दुसरा स्क्रीन में जाए तो तुम्हारा एखाद स्क्रीन ही ऐड करूँ घया लगे आनतर तुम्हारा क्लास कॉल करा लगे इंटेंट हा इंटेंट नवाच क्लास है गेट एप्लिकेशन कॉन्टैक्ट मे मजा करंट स्क्रीन पास नेक्स्ट क्लास मे हा जावा फाइल मे जी का एक्सएमएल की ऐक्टिविटी है उदाहरण ऐक्टिविटी नेक्स्ट हे ऐक्टिविटी मे मैं जाए 
तर मला ह्या दोन वेळीच पास करायला लागले म्हणजे करंट स्क्रीनची व्हॅल्यू आणि नेक्स्ट क्लासची व्हॅल्यू आणि मग मला फंक्शन कॉल करायचे स्टार्ट ॲक्टिव्हिटी जेव्हा मी स्टार्ट ॲक्टिव्हिटी कॉल करेन तेव्हा नवीन स्क्रीन ओपन होईल सो वेन यू रन दिस प्रोग्राम सो वेन यू रन रन दिस प्रोग्राम यू यू हॅव टू गिव्ह युजर नेम अँड पासवर्ड जेव्हा तुम्ही प्रोग्राम रन करा तेव्हा तुम्हाला युजर नेम अँड पासवर्ड इथे द्यायचा आहे जर दोन्ही व्हॅल्यूज करेक्ट असतील तर तुम्ही नेक्स्ट स्क्रीनला डायरेक्ट होऊ शकता तर अशा प्रकारे आपण बघितलं आहे की हाऊ यू आर गोईंग टू रिडायरेक्ट टू अर न्यूज स्क्रीन इफ यू हॅव एनी डाऊट्स एनी क्वेश्चन यू कॅन पुट ऑन द कमेंट्स जर तुम्हाला एखादा पार्ट समजला नसेल किंवा एखादा काही क्वेश्चन असेल तर तुम्ही कमेंट्समध्ये लिहू शकता सो दिस वॉज द एंड ऑफ द टुडे सेशन थँक्यू